know which one that is. Oh! Please, there isn't much time. What is it? Not a lot. I forgot I was here. Please make it brief. We have much to do. No, I'm going. Is that a park bench? No. Right. Do do do. Do 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 Huh? Don't run off. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Uh Falkreath. Climb and back and we'll be off. Get up there. Ready to go. Still here. Uh huh. Did you see a dog out there? Nope. Nope. Some wolves, but no dogs. Oh well. The blacksmith. What? The gods. There's a dragon. Olivia. Well done. We will speak to him, but not right now. Oh, this is a bit. What can I do for you? Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Thank you. I'm looking for a guy called Marcus Janus. Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Are you Marcus Janus? You wanted to see me about Halgen. Oh, bless the divines, you came! Well met, and welcome. We have much to discuss. Will you tell me, what happened at Helgen? You already know Helgen was attacked by a dragon. Have you ever seen one? We'll start with after. Uh -huh. Your past is none of my concern. That's not what Which I said. Survived, however, is. Did you see if anyone else made it out of there? Where are the families, the children? I doubt any civilians made it out of there alive. The place was laid to waste. Then it's as I feared. His name is Valerius Tiberius Artoria. We served for many years together in the Imperial Legion, as captains under Titus Mede II during the Great War. He was a good man in those days, 
an honorable man. Then the Aldmeri invaded and murdered his wife, son, and daughter in cold. Yeah, yeah. This is a long story. So what exactly does this have to do with me? I need you to go try and talk to Valerius. Reason with him. Tell him Marcus Janus requests a meeting with him. Tell them Marcus Janus sent you to see Valerius Tiberius Artoria on urgent business. Yeah, I got it, I got it. Show them this note with my seal, but tell them it's for Valerius. His eyes only. Please, return to me as soon as you can. I'll prepare to leave and be ready to go when you return. Monies. Make haste, young one. And may fortune favor the foolish. No monies. There you are. Right, we need to go. Need something? Right. Take it easy. even think about me. I wasn't. You see my friends coming? They won't hesitate to kill you if you so much as breathe funny. Now, who are you? And what is the meaning of this intrusion? Quickly now, speak. Easy now. I'm not here to start any trouble. Then you need to give me a reason why we shouldn't just kill you where you stand. I have an urgent matter that I need to discuss with Valerius. I know he's here. Never heard of him. You are mistaken. There's nobody by that name here. Now, be on your way. We don't want to hurt you. I have an urgent message from Marcus Janus. I must be given passage. You don't know him either. I'm beginning to run out of patience with what you. What the hell are you doing? Now. Come on, I know who you are, and you're no bandits. I don't know who you are, stranger, or what you are. You will. But I advise you to choose your words very carefully from here on out. Here, I have a gift from Marcus. It's Val's wife's wedding ring. Let me see that. Hmm. Did you say Marcus Janus? I did. From the yep. war, Marcus Janus. Why didn't you say I did. so? I did. And I have a letter from him to Valerius. His eyes only. Very well. I will take you inside. But all of us have our eyes on you. Okay. And if you try and start trouble, it will be the last trouble you ever start. Mm -hmm. Follow me. He has a very funky axe. I'm coming. You got the same hairstyle as a guy at my work. What do you think you're doing? Who is this person and why have you brought them here? He has an urgent message for you from Marcus Janus. He was alone and I thought you would want to talk to him. What? Huh. Marcus Janus? Falfring, have you gone completely mad? That's impossible. Hello? I thought the same thing, sir, but it's true. He showed me a letter to you with Marcus's seal. It's real, all right. And Lydia's sir, just wandered off down there. Marcus has found Sabrina's wedding ring and sent it to you. It's true. Very well. We'll see about this. Well, Frank, you are dismissed. All of you may resume your patrols. Yes, sir. I don't know who you are or why you're here, so you'd better have some good answers to my questions. May I see that ring? Yes, take it. It's yours. So you were sent by Marcus Janus? Where is he now? He's in Falkreath, waiting for me to return with your answer. And do you know how he came into possession of this ring? He must have found it in the Imperial City after you were imprisoned. Yes, yes, I suppose that may have been possible, but I... this is all so overwhelming. I'm sorry for the loss of your family. Thank you. 
I loved them very That was really sincere. I nearly went mad after they were murdered by those Altmarie dogs. Come on in. You got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. How many customers? Oh. Oh, hello. Need something? I talked to Val. He agreed to meet with you. Excellent. Well done, my friend. I'm ready to go, but there's just one. You're a bit of a coward. I'm getting too <laughs> old for fighting. Well, at least by myself, that is. I was hoping that it wouldn't be too much of a burden on you to escort me to the keep. There's another 250 gold in it for you if Sweet. you will. Okay, stick close to me. Let's go. I'm right behind you, but don't go too fast. Unlike you young ones, I'm not cut out for this shite anymore. Here we go again. Valerius Tiberius Arctoria, you old dog. How do you want me? Come here, my friend. Let us have a look at you. You stay with me. Marcus, we'll just watch. I've got your back. Valerius, I'm sure this is quite a shock to you. Terribly unexpected. I came here to check on my right family. Right behind you. <laughs> then I realized you were here, so I decided it was in both our interests for two old friends to meet again. At last. Ah, oh, your brother, yes. Marcus, I'm very sorry. But whatever the circumstances, it does my eyes good to see you again after all these years. <sighs> yes. Same here. Oh, you talk so much. So, keepers of Hatu in Skyrim. Who would have ever dreamed of such a time? All right, Janice, what is it you really want? Don't forget, I know... He wants you to tell you a boring story. Yes, you do know me, old friend, better than most. Let's just catch up on old times. Oh, you're in luck, Janice. Those bandits left some fresh wine downstairs. I need a drink. Yes, I could use... Me too. Friend. Let me say goodbye to my new friend. Oh. I'll join you. Something I else I can can't do for thank you. 250 you. gold. As agreed, here is your compensation. Thank you, but you never mentioned rebuilding Helgen until now. Why? I apologize for that. I certainly wasn't intentionally keeping anything from you. I just wanted to meet with Valerius before I brought it up. But yes, I want to make Helgen my home. But she certainly has seen better days, that's for sure. Think about it. That'll give Valerius and I some time to catch up and come up with a plan. Can you return to see us in a day or so? Okay, I will see you later. Thank you once again, friend. I'll see you then. Now then, Marcus, let's go get that wine. You're in one piece, so I trust your trip went smoothly. New mission. I'm still here. You could really go off and do your own thing for a bit. Uh... Still here. Wait, you know, drop. Wow. Not. Are you prepared? I'm ready for whatever test is next. This is no test, new blood. This is a gift. Come inside. <sighs> 